after the initial photography, um, we had to fill the bits in that we'd missed, and um, so we had a weekend of pickups, which we've just completed, and it involved it, uh, hiring some more kits, bringing a couple of actors back again, and um, redressing some sets so they look like middle of summer rather than February. Um, we finally finished all the shooting, so it's all in, it's in the uh, post-production now, so hopefully by end of April, beginning of May, we'll have a finished feature film. Yeah, it's all, all based in York, it's all filmed in York. I think the first one out was Thursk, which is still a York area, and and all the crew and all the all the cast are pretty, pretty local, not too far away. I think we should use York more. Uh, we've got two universities that are bringing out students that are qualified in, in the industry. So there's no reason why York could be a more of a film, film city. It's been a long process altogether. I think it's two years, I think, since, since I, I spoke to Miles and Tony. Um, Joe did a fantastic job of um, getting a collection of actors together that she thought would be uh, perfect for the past, and she got it spot on, basically. And everyone really bonded well, and you could tell that at the rap party, everyone was kind of sad that it was all over, but happy at the same time. It's a big family. Strange, yeah, it'd be weird. Um, yeah, producer of a film. Um, you know, people go through life and never get the chance to. But we, through meeting Miles and Tony, basically, I've been able to fulfil an ambition which I've had for many years. You, know, you, you have ideas, you always have ambitions, but trying to fulfil it is quite hard. They've they've moved on as well in the in the film industry. They've they've up their game as well, so it's a development for them. And also it's, it was a it was a step step onto the ladder of filmmaking for me as well. So and I'd like to do it again. Um, I'd like more sleep next time, please. Less night shoots. <laughs>